In this tutorial, we will assemble the US Digital E16 Micro Optical Kit Encoder. Your E16 kit includes the mounting base, a cover, a printed circuit board, a hub disk, a spacer tool, a centering tool, and two mounting screws. Please note the E16 is designed for one-time installations. Let's get started with step one, installing the mounting base to the motor. You'll notice I am wearing gloves to protect the optical components, as well as an ESD wrist strap. Because the base is so small, we suggest you start by putting the provided mounting screws into the slots on the base. Next, slip the base over the shaft and do a partial turn on one screw to keep the base aligned, but do not tighten it fully. Next, slide the centering tool onto the shaft until it comes in contact with the mounting surface. While applying light pressure to the centering tool, tighten screws down to the torque specified in the product datasheet. We'll put a link in the video description. Once both screws are tightened, we can remove the centering tool for later installations. In step two, we're going to install the printed circuit board. While handling the PCB, be careful to avoid directly touching the optical sensor, which is opposite of the connector. We're going to line up the two holes in the PCB with the two pins on the base. The base is symmetrical, so the connector can exit out of either side. Make sure the PCB is fully seated against the base before continuing to the next step. In step three, we're going to install the hub disk onto the shaft. While installing the hub disk, make sure the bore is parallel to the shaft. Forcing the hub disk onto the shaft at an angle could cause permanent damage. Place the hub disk onto the shaft with the longer end of the hub toward the base. Position the spacer tool onto the hub so that the notches are aligned with the latches on the base. Press down firmly until the tool rests on the base latches. We can now remove the spacer tool for later installations and move on to the final step. Snap the cover onto the base, making sure both base latches are fully engaged with the cover. 316 is now installed and ready for use. Thank you for watching. For more information, visit usdigital.com.